It's almost like God knew what he was doing by putting us men as the spiritual leaders in our homes and, and in our marriages, right? But you guys, can I say, it doesn't mean that you're large and in charge and everybody does what you says. No, being a godly man means that you give and you serve and you sacrifice and you provide and you protect and you take responsibility for the good of those other people that are living in your house. That's what godly men do. And so, man, that's what I want to challenge you to do. As men who make up Cross Point City Church, I want to encourage you and challenge you out of love to be godly men, to love Jesus more than anything else in life, to love your wife like Jesus loved his church, and you give yourself up for that woman no matter what it means. You give your life over to discipling those kids and pouring your life into them and showing them what it means to follow your Lord and Savior. And if you will do that, there is a great probability that all those people in your house are going to follow you. Be godly men. And then young single men in the room, can I just challenge you in love? Start that now. Start this now. Like I know some of you young single dudes, you're like, Bro, no girl wants to really date me or be in a relationship with me. Can I give you some advice that I think is going to help you? You ready? Godly women are not looking to date boys. They're looking for godly men. Boys are what society often says are men, okay? Boys are all about them. Their pride, their ego, their influence, their power, their money, and just selfishness, pure selfishness. Godly women don't want a guy like that. And so if life is still all about you, I would say you need to grow out of boyhood and embrace manhood. Like young single dudes, take some responsibility for you and get a job and start providing and get out of the parents' house and and start getting out there and, and doing life on your own. Love Jesus, serve him, prioritize the good of other people. And I can guarantee if you'll start doing that, at some point along the way, you're gonna meet some godly woman who's gonna look at you and go, I've been looking for a guy like you. Up until now, it's just been a bunch of silly little boys. And wow, I've actually found a godly man, someone who gives and serves and sacrifices and cares and protects and provides and takes responsibility. And young single men, here's what I'm telling you, man. If you will do that now, if and when God gives you your own family someday, you will be ready to lead them in the ways of Jesus. Men, be godly men. Man, our world needs it more than ever. Men who will step up and give their whole hearts to Jesus Christ for his glory, for the good of our families, for the good of our world. Amen?